Okay, guys. Um, wanted to show you since I was rescreening, uh, well, not rescreening, but building the screen uh, frame, my work service uh, temporarily. Let's move this out of the way. Uh, I made a shooting bench. So, um, went online and I found uh, a design that was free. I'm not going to pay uh, for the drawings for a shooting bench. And there's scads of them online. Um, and I happened to see this one. And I'll turn, let me turn it up on end uh, so you can get an idea. Um, two seats. One for left-handed, one for right-handed shooters. And uh, it had some rough dimensions in the plan. Uh, and you can find it, it's, it's very easy to find. Uh, I don't have a uh, plan with me or the guy uh, who drew it, but it, it's rough dimensions. And you'll have to figure out some of the uh, height, distance, and width uh, yourself. But just thought I'd show you uh, some specifics. And yeah, basically, uh, it's going to be 36 inches wide. Um, it's made out of treated wood. Um, so, what I did is overbuild it because that's what I had available. Uh, these are six by sixes. I, I did not have to buy those. I actually found uh, uh, eight foot six by six treated at uh, a bank on property I was working with and uh, said well you know I can use that and so essentially uh, the front legs six by six uh, these back legs we got three of them Six by six as well. You, you don't have to have six by six. Uh, it could be four by four. Four by four would be fine. But I had those because I'd rather than have the uh, six by six by eight hanging around, I was going to use them. Um, these, uh, those, those are one by sixes that I used to frame it out. Um, this is a one by ten seat. Uh, these are decking boards. Uh, so the nice thing about this is that I didn't have to buy any wood with the exception of three decking boards. Uh, so I'm going to turn it on end so you can see the other side as far as how it's constructed. This is stain, this is not paint. Um, I had that on hand for a uh, porch that I got to do this summer. Uh, so you can see it is very sturdily built. I screwed it instead of nailed it. So I used uh, three and a half inch decking screws uh, all around with the only exception being uh, I used two inch Yes, two inch uh, screws for the top here, the decking boards. As you can see, that was new lumber. I had to buy the, the decking boards. So that ended up being three new decking boards, but that's, you know, that's all the expense I've got in it, fortunately. Uh, I had everything else, as I said. Uh, one of the things that you will have to do, I, I did all of this with a uh, skill saw and a miter saw. I uh, had to use a skill saw, obviously, and a, and a hand saw. Uh, you have to use that skill saw to cut each of these four sides on this six by six, and that'll still leave a little area in the middle that you can take the, the hand saw and uh, finish out. So I had to do that with each of these five legs. Um, I did buy 12 3 8 by three and a half inch lag screws. Um, the lag screws I used in addition to the 
uh, actual three and a half inch deck and screw. So there's a lag screw, there's a lag screw, there's a lag screw. And I have two on the front supports uh, as well, right here. So that's the reason I can turn it on end and don't have to worry about it. So I've got three and a half inch deck and screws that I put it together with, plus those lag screws. And again, they're three eighths by four inch. So it's plenty sturdy. Uh, the actual drawing for this had it, uh, these legs were longer and they were to be uh, planted in concrete. Well, I did not want to do that because I want to be able to move it. Um, so this will be fine. Uh, I wanted it both. Uh, and it is something I can load up on a trailer uh, and carry. Uh, two men can pick it up and carry it short distances to reposition it. Uh, a couple of things I did want to note for you. You'll need a table saw. Um, because I had to rip one of those decking boards. Uh, if you look here, you can see it. Uh, this full piece, full piece, full piece, full piece, full piece, but right here, I had to rip uh, a decking board to one and three quarter inch. And then I used that same piece that I ripped to finish this out. This is one and a half inch on the end. Uh, also, I rounded the corners here with uh, an orbital sander. Um, so, you know, it doesn't snag you, um, get uh, splinters in you, what have you. Um, and uh, as I said, I did every corner that way. Um, just to, to kind of finish it off. Uh, so I, it'll serve my purpose very well. Um, uh, for right-handed shooters, sit right here. Left-handed on the other side. Uh, it is very, very sturdy. Uh, like I said, it's overbuilt, uh, but that's fine. And uh, if I were to make another one, I'd actually adapt the design a little bit. Um, I'd make it so these were full, so you wouldn't have to rip anything. So you do have to have a skill saw, you've got to have a chop saw or a miter saw, you got to have a table saw. Uh, I used cordless drill uh, for uh, the deck screws and I used a um, impact driver to put the lag screws in. Um, so you got to have just very fundamental simple uh, tools. Uh, but I like the fact it's overbuilt. Um, it is very sturdy, it's treated, it should last the rest of my life. Uh, I'm, I'm going to put, uh, probably put this under a shelter and shoot in a, in a field anyway. Uh, so it's not going to get a lot of weather. But if I do want to move it under a tree and let it sit out in the weather, it'll be fine for years and years and years. So, again, I just wanted to show you that. Um, since I was using it in a previous video, the work surface, I haven't moved it out to uh, the farm where I'm going to be uh, shooting. So, uh, again, pretty easy to do. Minimal expense, even if you had to buy everything. Uh, if you have to buy everything, obviously I'd go with the... Uh, four by four legs, two by fours here will be fine. Um, the deck and boards, uh, I would make my seats this wide though, uh, so that one by ten would have to uh, be a little expense, but that's fine. You don't need, I mean, an eight footer to be more because I made that a little longer than the plan. But there you go. It's it's. Served my purpose well for years. Uh, I just thought I'd give you a, a look at that. Uh, hope it helped. If you've got any questions, just send me a, uh, a comment. Thanks.